Hello everyone, this is Ted Check, Public Relations Manager for the International Foundation for Protection Officers. Here to give you the uh, security good deed of the day, or well, we're going to kick off 2021 uh, with a good deed, and, and hopefully there will be, actually I, I feel pretty certain there will be many more of these to come. You know, uh, typically in the media we're bombarded with bad news about security officers. Uh, security officers seen in a negative light and uh, hopefully here um, at the IFPO and in other places we can do uh, a lot to uh, kind of reverse that or to at least show some of the positive things uh, that security officers are doing around the world. So this time we take you to Maui. Uh, which is in Hawaii, uh, as most of you know, and uh, this is Maui Now. That's the uh, that's uh, the YouTube channel that we're on, and uh, the uh, the situation is that a security officer named Ana Townsend found a wallet, and uh, he got it back to his uh, to to the wallet's owners uh, as soon as he possibly could, and obviously without doing anything to the wallet, uh, just out of the kindness of his heart, he, uh, he went above and beyond and uh you know got this uh, person's personal property and and return it to them asap and um in return there was a gofundme that was set up because uh someone realized hey this guy doesn't have transportation really all he has is a bike and so they got him a car and uh it's just it's just a great way of uh of paying it forward and so let's take a look at a little bit of this um a little bit of this video there you see ana uh in his securitas uniform He's uh, signing the uh, the papers, and there he's got his new car. Right, they call that an aloha moment. Uh, Gray Marino is the uh, is the husband of the of the woman who lost her. There she is, Chloe Marino. She's she's the one who lost the uh, the wallet. So then Ana uh returned returned the wallet and that's that's just that's just a great thing and there he is uh at the car dealership doing what's right that's what he says doing what's right and and what what more can you ask for in a uh in a security professional than than doing what's right Yeah, and, and and it couldn't have couldn't have come at a better time. With with the uh, with the holidays just around the corner. So there you go. That that's uh, Anna Townsend. Uh, he is he is you know kudos to him. Did a fantastic job there. Best of luck to him in his uh, continued career in security. Um, and and as as he said, you know he he immediately uh, I think they. Um, I don't know if I can advance it here, but he he immediately took off in his car and, and went to work. Um, so the guy is uh, is you know just a hard worker, and um, that's that's just amazing. Now I did want to go over to the IFPO's website ifpo.org and direct you to uh, our educational and training programs. This is if you want to elevate your secur security career. Um, you know you want you want to climb the ladder of success. And uh, here we have some news uh, coming soon. IFPO hosted webinars. This is going to be a great thing launching uh, this month because here we are January 1st of 2021. The International Foundation for Protection Officers will host a series of monthly webinars and uh, you can read the rest here. I'm not going to read the whole thing to you, but if you go to ifpo.org slash training dash programs, you can read that. But I also did want to go over our major programs here. Uh, you've got the Certified Protection Officer. That's kind of the flagship. Um, that's that's the uh, highly recognizable certification around the world um, that gives you a smattering of just about everything that you could encounter as a uh, as a security officer. Then you can move up from there. You can get your certified in security supervision and management certification. You can become certified uh, a certified protection officer instructor. So there's uh, there's there's many ways that you can uh, there's there's pathways many pathways that you can that you can explore, um, and those are just some of them, uh, at the International Foundation for Protection Officers. So make sure to head over to ifpo.org for that. 
um, and uh, we will uh, we will be doing uh, we'll be focusing more on this YouTube channel. We'll be having more interviews. We'll be having more uh, little news programs like this. As I said, we're going to highlight the positive because there's a lot of it out there. Um, unfortunately, there's the negative, but that's with any profession. But we're going to highlight the positive. And so uh, I want to thank everybody for tuning in. As I said, make sure to go to ifpo.org for more information on our training programs. Um, you know, you won't regret it. It's, it's a great program. All of them are great. And they will really set you off on the pathway to success in the security industry. Thanks so much. Talk to you soon.